Cohesion and adhesion, properties of water. Cohesion is when water stick to itself. So here in the bottom left, you see our water molecules and they're tightly bond to each other in a liquid form. So here we see is a penny that usually when if you were to drop any type of liquid on it, the liquid would just flow out. But whereas if you drop water droplets on it, it starts to accumulate and then it creates this kind of concave effect. Water kind of attached to each other and they fill up, they stick to each other so they don't fall out until it reaches its maximum amount then eventually it's just going to burst. But in the meantime, water will concave and they stick to each other. Now cohesion can also create surface tension. That's when the strider can stand on the water. Cohesion by itself is not necessarily important yet. Then there's adhesion. Adhesion is when water sticks to other things. Adhes means to adhere, clinging, and the uh, ION part is the action or the condition of. So here you have a glass and then water sticks to the glass. Capillary action, that's when the water goes up to the root of the tree. And we see here is a capillary action. See how the water just kind of sucked itself up into that? It doesn't require much energy. So cohesion when with adhesion is very important. It helps, for example, capillary action, water up the roots of trees. And that is important because it saves the tree a lot of energy. And that's why some trees grow to be so big. Because the energy is saved, it doesn't require the bowl of the water, it can be used for other things. And of course, whatever is good for plants is going to be good for us. A dead chemist. What do you do when you see a dead chemist? You bury him. Now I wonder why the chemist died in the first place. 